In this tutorial, we're going to learn how to add end credits or close end credits like the ones you see in the movies. So uh, the first thing you want to do here is go to Effect Library and then look for, let's see, text. I don't know where text is. Here it is, titles. And then look for scroll. Okay. I'm just going to put it here. Um, the next thing you want to do is click on the scroll that you just added and just hover over with your playhead. Let me close the effect library so we have some more space. I'm going to turn off this thing. Snap in. Okay, and you can see the title here. Now, with the title selected or the scroll effect selected, come to alignments and then adjust to center. You can choose any fonts or typeface from here. Uh, and decrease the size, of course. And then if you have the titles or the text, you can just add them here, okay? I'm not gonna type actual things because uh, it's gonna be so wasteful. It's gonna be such a waste of time. Just type in whatever here, just so I can let you know, guys. All right, so the haircuts were so dramatic that we need and uh, end credits or closing credits. Okay. Ooh, because usually there is a lot of sex guys. I'm sorry that I'm doing this. I just bear with me. All right, this is. Now if I click play, uh, but you can see it's going fast and we know that it doesn't go that fast in the movies. So click on the scroll effects and then right click, change clip duration and then here I can add for example instead of having 5 seconds, 35. Click change. Now click play. Let me add that fade out thing. End of the movie. Yeah, fade into this, yeah. Oh no, it's good, eh? It's good. You can add as much text as you want, man. No limits. You know, only the sky is the limit. Okay, guys, and here you have it, man. Here you have it. Okay, you can really adjust everything here. And yeah, here you go.